playing here, practicing every day with the with the colleagues. Uh, play the tournament, uh, even if the um, my my personal uh, preparation haven't been there. Uh, that's the probably the the faster way possible to to recover a lot of things that uh, I I don't have now yet. No, but I hope to to have it back in a couple of weeks if if I'm able to practice with the right uh, attitude and uh, with the humility to to accept uh, the challenge and to accept that there uh, are going to be days that the things are not going the, the right way and it's all about the process, trust the process and uh, at the same time uh, trust in, in myself uh, that even the things are not going well today uh, can be better tomorrow and better and better every single day. Hi Rafa, talking about coming back, you know how to come back. Um, uh, I'm from Austria, that's why I'm interested especially in about the story of Dominic Team. He's a little bit struggling about coming back right now. Maybe have you talked to him about his way of coming back and the way, the way you came back in Australia, is that an absolute uh, exception about how coming back? That's not like the usual way? No, it's true. Uh, so um, it's not the moment to put pressure on, on Dominic. Uh, and it's not fair to compare about me because in in that case uh, I am not the guy uh, who likes to talk about uh, myself uh, in a good way. Uh, but it's true that um, the way that I was able to to come back a lot of times in, in my tennis career is uh, is something uh, special and uh, is not something usual. Uh, because uh, when you're coming back from a long period of time without playing, uh, the normal thing is uh, have a, a process, and uh, that's what Dominic is going through. And I, I don't have any doubt that he will be, if he's healthy, he will be back uh, this week, next week, uh, in Roland Garros, or if not in Wimbledon or after. No, it's about time. Uh, he has, uh, if he really has the the determination. The, the passion to keep going. I don't have any doubt that he will recover 100% the level, but it's about time and uh, it's a process that you need to go through. Hi, good morning. Uh, I wanted to go back to Australia again because uh, I wanted to, to know when you, like months later, if you look back and you realize the incredible thing that you did over there. Mm. Uh, so I just wanted to, to talk about what happened in Australia having this all this time to have think about it and you have a long career but what you did over there was so outstanding that I wanted to I don't know like maybe self-awareness of the incredible thing that you did Thank well, you. I, I tell you one thing uh, uh, <laughs> one of the reasons why I am here and why I am uh, competitive at uh, almost 36 years old uh, is because I don't think much about the things that happened uh, in the past, no. So uh, I am not uh, a fan of uh, stays a lot of time uh, remember, remembering uh, how good uh, the thing was or how bad the thing was. You know, uh, in our sport, uh, there is not much time to to think about Australia anymore. It's past. Uh, things go fast. Uh, Australia have been amazing, without a doubt. Have been uh, one of the most emotional moments in my tennis career. But during the last month that I have time to think in, in what I was thinking is about, about my injury. And <laughs> I was sad about that. <laughs> and uh, the, the thing that I was uh, trying to do is just think about what I need to do to recover and to be ready for, for when I am coming back. Uh, it's not a sport that you have time uh, to stay uh, with the victories and to celebrate a lot of the victories if you want to keep being competitive for... For uh, for the next couple of events, and that's uh, and that's what I tried to do. Even like this, uh, we can talk about Australia in another time, any time. Uh, of course, have been so special, and the way that I achieved that title is is something unforgettable for the rest of my life, without a doubt. Uh, but the life continues now, and uh, that's it. I'm here in Madrid to try my best. That's all. <laughs> Thank you.